Kids, I've got some bad news. Your father's drinking problem has gotten worse and he had another DUI. That's his third one. I know, and this time the judge said he's going to have to spend some time in jail. For how long? For two long months. <laughs> There's no way he can do that. <laughs> no kidding, I haven't seen him without a drink for a day, let alone two months. But I know, it's going to be tough on all of us. Alright, but let's just hope that your father can tough it out. Remember, we all love you. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Bye bye. Is that dad? Yep. What are you saying? How's he doing with his booze? He said that he's never felt so free and, and alive in his life. It's been a life altering experience. <laughs> That's great. I just can't believe he's not freaking out without his beer. I know. Your dad said he doesn't even care about drinking anymore. No way. Oh, he said that he has candy three times a day and he's doing fine. Whatever works. How would candy help someone with a drinking problem? I don't know. I think it's because alcohol and candy both have sugar in it, so maybe the brain tricks itself and helps them satisfy its cravings. I'm not sure. Well, without having so much candy, at least I'll have a sober father. He'll just weigh 400 pounds. <laughs> you made it through that jail sentence. Oh, I could have never done it without the support of you and the kids. And don't forget, you had a little help from the candy. Oh, I completely forgotten all the excitement. What, honey? What's wrong? Hold on just a minute. These are my new friends, Candy. 